Welcome to this series of videos about procedurally generating a voxel world using Unity Engine. Hi, I'm Peter and welcome to Sunny Valley Studio Tutorials. The idea is that we want to generate an endless world with nice looking landscape using procedural generation. Since this is not a trivial task, I will split this series into about three sections. In this first one, we will want to explore how we can create a voxel engine, so a way to build our world out of cubes by generating a single mesh. If you are watching this tutorial just after release, this is what will be available right now. Next section that I will upload will be about procedural generation and how we can make the terrain look more natural when it comes to landscape and how to create the different biomes. We will use Perlin Noise, Domain Wrapping and Voronite Tessellation to achieve a decent looking terrain. Last section will be about making our code multi-threaded so that we can freely roam our terrain, not worrying about the frame rate drops, because we are going to first generate our data on a separate thread before we go to the main thread and render our chunks, so this will prevent any freezing in our game when we generate more terrain. By the time you are watching this video, probably all the sections are already uploaded and available, but right now we are going to start from the first section, which is about creating a voxel engine. Now to create the visualization for our voxel world, I will be using Kenny Assets, the voxel pack that contains some awesome textures that we can use for our project. Now to improve the visual side of our world, I'm using the free customable skybox asset from the Unity Asset Store. Both of the links will be in the description. In the next video, we will talk about the theory behind the voxel world, so what are voxels and so on, what we need to create our voxel engine. By the way, if you are enjoying this tutorial, be sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, it helps me a lot. See you in the next video.